hello guys welcome to my channel if you're stumbling on my channel for the very first time this is change your look uk and on today's video i'm going to be showing you how you can actually lay your front uh, without no gum no gut to be no nothing for you won't believe that i didn't actually use anything like gum glue got to be gel any form of hold on this front arm it's looking as if it's laid with a gum or hold or so but there is nothing like a gum hold on this front arm right now most of the time i wear a lot of front arm but 95 percent of the time that i wear front arm i don't lay it down I so I'm going to be showing you the trick on how you can actually rock your frontal with that gum, glue less. You will lay your frontal and it will look as if you gummed it, but you didn't actually apply any gum on it. And I always wear frontal and when I go out, when I come into the house, I just want to take off my wig and I don't want to go through the stress of putting water or spraying it and try to remove it. So I'm going to be showing you how you can actually rock your hair with that gum without any form of gum to it all you need to do is just wear your wig when you come back you can actually take it off and then wear it again so guys i won't take too much of your time but before we jump into this video if you've not hit the subscribe button please do it free to hit on the subscribe button and press on the notification bell for you to be notified whenever i upload a new video i do upload new videos every week so if you don't want to miss any of my video please click on the notification bell when you click on the notification bell youtube will be able to notify you whenever i upload a new video so it's very important that you click on the notification bell so guys without taking too much of your time let's dive into this video thank you so much for stopping on my channel i already pre-plugged the front out i don't want the video to be too long that's the reason why i do it off cam but if you want to see how i pre plug i'm going to be, leave a comment in the comment section i'm going to do a video and show you how i actually pre plug but mind you i don't do that over pre plucking i always want my lace frontal to look as natural as possible and when you over pre plug it at first it will look very beautiful but i bet you after the first time you won't really like your frontal i bet you for that i can bet anything for that you won't really like it so that's the reason why when i do my pre-plucking i just do it very very mild i don't over pre-pluck so what i'm just doing right now is to apply styling mousse on it applying the styling mousse will be able to make me to see the amount of baby hair that i'm taking out of the hair so that's the reason for it so if you want to um, cut a baby hair out of your hair try to apply styling mousse and this um, styling mousse is really really very nice try to apply it so you'll be able you can see how tiny the baby hair is so if i don't apply the styling mousse on it i won't be able to see the amount of baby hair i'm actually taking out of it so that's the reason why i have to apply the styling mousse before taking out the baby hair and the baby hair that i'm going to be doing i'm not laying anything flat i'm not going to style it or make it look like that baby hair the look i'm going for is those that kind of look that when you just enter water or you enter a pool you're coming out it just look as if your hair is just slip at the front that is the look i'm going for but if you want to style your baby hair on your own front uh, it's fine you can do that but the look i'm going on today is just a very very simple style and secondly when you try to like um lay your baby hair i see a lot of youtubers a lot of people use um got to be and they say they want to lay the baby hair and at the end of the day that got to be that they got to be glue they get to use it to hold the um frontal down to their scalp so i just this video is just to show you that without applying anything on your frontal you can actually lay your frontal and it will actually look as if you are laying it with a gum and you didn't actually apply any form of gum or hold on it so that's the reason for this um frontal tutorial i just want it to be as simple as possible as easy for those people who want to wear a frontal and they don't even like the idea of using got to be using any form of glue gum or anything this will really work for you guys seriously you can see how tiny the baby hair is the baby hair i cut from it you can see how tiny is it it looks that is what i'm actually going for very very tiny
so what I did now is to wear the um, wig on my hair to like check the length of the front hour because most of the time the front hour is always long so I just measure it by my ear and just cut the extra part out of it and then I will take it off my head and cut it on the mannequin head please if you're a beginner don't try to cut your lace frontal on your head if you don't actually know how to do it properly I'm a stylist I do this for clients but for one strange reason I cannot actually cut it on my head because I don't want to make any form of mistake so I always take it off my head and then cut it <laughs> on the mannequin head so if you are a beginner please don't even try it and if you are not good at trimming it please after taking the measurement just put it on your mannequin head and just trim it there it will work perfectly for you it will be better <laughs> And instead of using a scissors it's better you use this eyebrow trimmer this really work very well because it just gives that rough edge when you use scissors it's like a straight line but when you use this it gives it a rough edge except you know how to use the small scissors very well if you know how to use that very well then you should use you can use the scissors the smaller scissors but if you don't even want to go through those wahala just get this it's like one pound in all this shop Pakistani shop every other beauty shop you will get it there is not more than one pound so it will work better for you because just give it that rough look that natural look so you can see how the cap inside the cap is that is how we make our wigs and change your look if you want to order wig from us it has to be very very neat seriously extremely neat so I would advise if you are applying your frontal make sure you apply the frontal before applying your makeup seriously because you can see the mess that my makeup has done everywhere is full of makeup and the makeup is just dripping out of my face it was so annoying but the idea is just to show you guys how to lay your front out not the makeup so i was fine with it The straightener is really really very good I'm telling you Bosch is very very good like it's one of the best in the market I think I got it from Amazon I'm going to be leaving the link so you guys can check it out if you're looking for a very very good straightener to use seriously this is like the best Now look at that, just take a good look at that, just take a very close look at that, do you see how that is looking, do you see how it's looking, you can't even find the ends, it looks very very nice, it came out really really nice, no one will actually believe that you didn't actually use any form of comb, 
hold on this frontal you're looking at right now you can see how lay it is it really looks very very nice seriously you can see the baby hair I'm talking about so I'm not styling the baby hair I'm just leaving it at the front for it to drop as if I just came out from the pool so that's the effect that's the vibe I want but if you want to style your baby hair why not you can do your style yours as well but I just want it to be dropping like that the way it is right now For some strange reason, I was trying to like define the part with my foundation and my hands were shaking. I don't know what happened. <laughs> my hand was really shaking. So, but I have a remedy for this. I just filmed this. I want you guys to see it. So if you happen to fall in this situation, this happens to you. So you know what to do. So all you need to do is to wet a rag, a cloth, a flannel and just wipe over the hair like on top of the hair don't clean into the lines you just wipe on top of the hair so i purposely filmed this for you guys to actually see it so if you happen to fall in this kind of situation then you just know the remedy for it so you don't have to worry you don't have to panic so you just wet your flannel a rag anything and just wipe over it and it will just go off so you can see that you can actually rock your frontal glueless without no glue on your frontal look at the way it's looking tell me if you won't if someone should tell you that there is no glue on this hair what will you think look at that hair look at how it looks it came out really really beautiful without no glue no got to be no form of gum no form of old on the hair and it's looking like this and it doesn't really take you time for you to achieve this it's a very simple beginner friendly tutorial I bet you you should give it a try so you can actually rock your frontal without no glue glueless So guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video, please don't hesitate to hit on the subscribe button if you've not subscribed to the channel. And we do upload new video every week. So if you don't want to miss any of our video, please hit on the subscribe button and press on the notification bell for you to be notified whenever I upload a new video. So thank you so much guys for watching and I'll be seeing you on my next one. Bye. And before we end the video, let me quickly take off this. Yeah. No form of order on it.